Welcome to Retro Crisis, and here are some useful hotkeys that you can use in RetroArch. Press page up or page down to scroll through your playlists much faster. This should allow you to skip to the next letter of the alphabet. Alternatively, press S on a playlist and you'll be able to type in the name of the game you're looking for. In game, if you keep hold of the R key, you'll be able to activate the rewind function. Press P at any point to pause the game. If you want to reset your game, simply press H. If you're using a shader, you'll be able to cycle to the next shader using the M key and you'll be able to cycle back to the previous shader using the N key. Press F1 at any point during gameplay to go to the RetroArch menu and simply press F1 again to return to your game. Press F2 to create a save state and press F4 to load that save state. You'll be able to change up to the next save slot by pressing F7 and you'll be able to change back to the previous save slot by using F6. If you want to take a screenshot, press F8. And if you need to pause the game audio at any point, simply press F9. Keep hold of the E key at any point to activate slow motion. And conversely, if you keep hold of the spacebar, you'll be able to increase the speed and go into fast forward mode. And finally, press F at any point to toggle between full screen and windowed mode. I really hope these hotkeys help enhance your RetroArch experience. If you know of any hotkeys that I've missed, please put them in the comment section. This has been Retro Crisis. I hope you'd consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching.